It was a great sight for Shackamack fans Monday night as Morgan Yair hit a home run as the Lakers won 11-6 over WRV. Well, it definitely started out rough for anyone that was here to witness it. We had a lot of errors that were just routine plays um, that we didn't make, and those are plays that we got to start making. We got to get better at if we wanted to advance any further. Um, luckily, our hitting, hitting came through, and we put some runs on the board to protect us because our defense definitely let us down a little bit tonight. Um, but we got to get better, and hopefully tomorrow night we'll come ready to put the whole aspect of the game together. The season, uh, I mean, I deem it a success. I mean, from where we started, um, the improvements the girls get, made, I mean, we're, you know, worried about even winning a game and to walk away and be competitive. I mean, for the majority of the season, we couldn't even get past five innings and, and to finish and be competitive. I couldn't be more proud of the girls and how hard they played and, and, and the effort they gave. So very, very successful. Um, really kind of similar. We, we really fought. I mean, we've only got 10. Um, we've got some injury challenges that we faced all year and we, we had to face that tonight and they, they picked each other up. Um, if one was hurt, we had to move somebody around and, and they filled in for each other. And um, they're truly a team and, and that's all you can ask for as a coach is that they come together and then they've got each other's back. So uh, very, very happy with them. In the nightcap at Clay City, Bloomfield took on North Central. Unfortunately for the Cardinals, the Thunderbirds got the best of them and won five to four. Ending Bloomfield season. Jack and Mac will take on North Central Tuesday night.